A few weeks ago, one of our viewers commented that we should pay a visit to this magnificent estate and review their houses. What this viewer did not know is that we had actually been here a while back with Raymond and we did a short video of these houses which we posted on uh, Instagram and TikTok and that short video actually did well. However, we are back to do the full tour and from here we can actually see the garage which you're going to see later on in the show but uh, let's continue and uh, I'm hoping that at this angle really so you can be able to get the facade of the house yeah. so that our viewers can see how this house looks from the street level yeah yep yeah and uh, it's magnificent what do you think about the window yeah, I like the, the, you know me, I'm a fan of huge windows yeah, and yeah. things that are not restrictive to, yeah. you know, you yeah. as a homeowner. Yeah, yeah. So this window is a very huge plus for me. Yeah. And I like the fact that it's not the only one. Oh, yeah. yeah. And from here you can see the travertine, yeah. cladding and the PVC, yeah. which is well incorporated. Huh? Yeah. And uh, gives the house a very natural but also colorful feeling. Yeah, it's actually a very durable PVC like, oh, yeah. uh, from the texture of it. Oh, yeah. Like you can feel how good it you is. You could actually think it's wood. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we even had a bit of argument about that. Huh? Yeah. And uh, again, this house is going for 121 million Kenya shilling. It's a 670 square meter house. That is almost 7,200 square feet. Huh? Yeah. And that is a lot of space. So today's show is going to be a long one. For those who don't like long shows, this has a lot of features to talk about. For example, in this case, they went with a ramp to access the front door instead of using uh, stairs. Eh? Yeah. So this is good for those people who might be a bit physically challenged and, yep. uh, you know, need maybe using a wheelchair and so on. Again, you have uh, this rail uh, that may protects you from falling over back to the, you know, yeah. the, the driveway. Especially with kids, yeah? Oh, yeah, especially with kids, yeah? And I like that they went with glass. And mm. uh, it's strong, I can ascertain that. Yeah. Just because it's glass doesn't mean that it's not strong. And uh, have you noticed these lighting features yeah. on your it's, travel yeah, 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 it's really, all over the, the ramp. Yeah. Oh, really cool. <laughs> Again, at the main door, you have these uh, concrete uh, beams that give you privacy. When you're going into your door or you're coming out, people from the driveway can actually uh, see you. Yeah. Remember, it's an open laid out estate. Yeah? Yeah. And again, you have uh, this extra space that continues and uh, well, well railed. Yeah. So for kids, again, it's safe. Yeah. And uh, I actually we saw one of the neighbors, uh, they did a water feature there. They did a water feature. Yeah. And yeah. this would be Very such a dope place. Uh, a, water, a water feature, a lot of plants. You yeah. know? So a nice way to welcome yourself to your home. Eh? Yeah. Notice the window that yeah. goes from all the down way. all the way uh, from the floor all the way to your upper ceiling. Yeah. This house is actually four levels. Yeah. So guys, when I say it's a lot of space, it is a lot of space. Let's walk inside so that we can see. Oh, before we walk aside, we have this uh, intercom system yeah. so that you can use uh, to, uh, to communicate with people inside. Yeah. Again, that means uh, you don't have to actually open the door not knowing who you're opening for. Yeah. So it's, it has a camera system and so on. Very nice. Huh? Yeah. Moving on, you have seen the magnificent door which has just been repainted. So once they undo these uh, saw tapes and the papers, to look very nice, huh? Yeah. And welcome to your entrance porch. Yeah. Which is really big. This is like a, it's a grad for you for real, eh? Yeah. Yeah, it's big. And uh, you have uh, this shopping that welcomes you. Nice storage space mm -hmm. to have by the door, place to place your keys and so on. Yeah. Again, you have, uh, this is uh, part of the intercom system that I was talking about. Yeah. And uh, notice the lighting, yeah? Yeah. And even the ceiling, the way it has been cladded with the, uh, uh, wood-like material. Yeah. Yeah, very nice. Such a nice vibe. 
and there's even a warm light on that edge. Mm. Wow. What really is what do you think about this entrance? I think it's amazing yeah. and the fact that they used, uh, should we call them blinders or what should we call them? So this is another way of, uh, they have used this to create uh, some privacy Se- yeah, from sort your of entrance separation. point and to yeah. your sitting area. Yeah. I know there are people who on our channel are always saying we don't want living rooms or we walk in yeah. straight on the door. Yeah. So this sort of creates that privacy and you have this on this side and then on this side where the, you have the stairs, they use the, these blocks of PVC. <laughs> Yeah. It's actually PVC. Yeah, they, they really look like wood. They look like wood. Yeah. I actually thought it's wood until I touched, <laughs> you it, touched like, it. Which I mean it. <laughs> <laughs> Again, we have to talk about the tiling. Yeah. It's well done. Here, we can say that things are really neat. Mm. And uh, this creates some privacy for your kitchen, which you're going to see on that end. Yeah. So let's move on to this side, which is your living space with a double ceiling. What do you think about the double heights? This is really nice. It opens up the living area, oh, so yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, it doesn't feel a little bit clustered or yeah, yeah, uh, smaller yeah. like other rooms. Yeah, yeah. So it really opens it up and I really like it. And the fact that it, it makes it possible to have those huge windows. Oh yeah. Yeah. And uh, you have this Big windows. Huh? Yeah. In fact, the whole house is almost like yeah. Your living room is living well room lit. Is you like don't even just, need lights. Yeah. You don't need the lights, that, but you have them, and you don't even notice them. Yeah. Because of the amount of natural light that you're getting in this yeah. room, and uh, from here you can see your your driveway, the driveway that continues on to your neighbors. Yeah. Again, you have this green space which you're going to see in a few, which is your space, your small yard, and uh, they have automated the cutting system. Yeah. So. Once you have your curtains Once, fixed, yeah, you you don't need to be <laughs> pulling them. Yeah, pulling this them. this would be a lot of work. Yeah, so you just have to press uh, the button, and uh, the automation does everything for you. Yeah, so it's it's a nice space. I love it, and I can even imagine hosting very nice parties, especially because you can access from here. You can see your family room above, which you're yeah. going to see later on. It yeah. would make a very nice ballroom for that matter. Yeah. Yeah. Moving on to your dining space. Again, this space is huge, guys. Yeah, it's huge. Yeah, this, yeah. This and can really fit well a good dining table. And because of the open layout that they have worked with, it makes it even look bigger. Yeah. And uh, more windows to bring in tons of natural lighting. All the cutting rails have been done for you, for those who worry about uh, privacy. Before we look at the kitchen, let's uh, step outside so that we can talk about there. But this uh, uh, green space, yeah, the yard. Yeah. Yeah, I, have, I have a question. Do you prefer if this was a sliding door or you just like it like that? Uh, in fact, I would prefer if it was, uh, you know, those automated sliding doors. Oh, yes. Yeah, yeah. I think <laughs> this house would do well with that kind of uh, uh, stuff. Yeah. And Maybe uh, a fixture you can do for yourself as Yeah, as that's moving. something you can do for yourself. Yeah. So for those people who normally when people buy these houses, they also... You, you have to add on the subject changes you have to make. Yeah. So for those who prefer like an automated system, sliding doors, that, mm-hmm. would, that would be really cool. Also makes that when you're closing off your doors, it's easy and fa- fast and uh, easier. Yeah. 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 So this is your lawn space. It's not that big, but uh, you get the idea. Yeah. And uh, remember, for those who might be wondering where we are today, this is Lavington. So space here is not that much. Yeah. And it's expensive. So to even get this space, this for Laviton, this is big. Yeah, this is big. <laughs> this is big. <laughs> so and uh, with your big uh, living room and open laid out kitchen, plus this space, it will be good for parties. Yeah. Yeah, because you have people moving in and out of your space. Yeah. 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 Even just for sitting, uh, maybe if you if you're someone who smokes. Yeah. This will be a nice place to. <laughs> yeah, you can. Sp- yeah. You had to measure smoking. <laughs> <laughs> Again, from this <laughs> angle, really, before we walk inside the house, uh-huh. I want you to show uh, this side of the house so that they can see that the travertine. And this is a very nice material. Yeah. So it is waterproofing. Yeah. So it means your walls are not exposed to to water. Yeah. And uh, if you can remember, the house we showed last week mm-hmm. had a lot of peeled out painting. Yeah. And that is because we, uh, over time, Paint is, uh, though we have waterproof paints, most of the times paints are not long lasting when it comes to waterproofing exterior, yeah. Yeah, exteriors. So this is a nice way of uh, working out your exteriors. Might be expensive, 
but it's worthy. And uh, that's a good idea that uh, your v our viewers or building can borrow. Again, notice the PVC continues. And actually, all the areas that are exposed mm. are well covered, either with travertine or, or the PVC. With the PVC. Yeah. So that means uh, it is well protected and you won't have those, you know, you won't see peeling paints in one year's time. Yeah? yeah. And then you start doing renovations. So back inside the house, uh, I think I did not mention this uh, chandelier, chandelier yeah. which is uh, really nice, it's cool. Again, because of the so much natural lighting that you get with this house, yeah. you might forget to talk about this the lights. lighting fixtures. Huh? And then the fact that they used ascent lighting and not oh, yeah. uh, lights that are in your face. In your face, yeah. yeah. And now we're in the kitchen. Again, notice the flow. We're just from the door to the living room, to yeah, the dining area, yeah. outside, outdoors, and now we're back inside. The kitchen, you have a lot of cabinetry. Yeah. And uh, one of the things we noticed is that uh, this cabinetry and the worktops are low. Yeah. So this is easy for especially uh, short people. <laughs> You're all covered, <laughs> yeah. And, uh, but it's, it's good height. Huh? Yeah. And uh, again, notice all the worktops that you have and the cabinetry space, even on this side, that is a space for your fridge. Mm -hmm. And uh, we don't get to see houses with dishwashers a lot. Yeah. This is that house with a dishwasher on yeah, the channel. Yeah. Yeah. So when we see one, we have to open it. Yeah. And uh, wow, there you it's go. A very decent one. Yeah. I mean, for this space, it actually makes it look yeah. awesome. Oh, it, yeah. it blends in with the cabinet. Yeah. One thing I think I haven't said yet is that I like the choice of colors in this house. Yeah. Like the white and the With dark. the contrast. Yeah. The contrast of dark. Yeah. Colors. And notice the kitchen is tiled all the way to the top. Yeah. And your sockets are well fixed. You can see, you don't see any clouds on the sides. Yes. So it's clean, very clean. And you have your double sink set up there. Mm -hmm. They decided to put uh, the banners at the island, making it more functional. Actually, this kitchen is everything that i would want for a kitchen oh yeah a functional island yeah. um open laid out yeah. Uh, yeah and you know it's minimalistic yeah yeah this is my idea Actually, of what you I don't have manage. many things here just yeah. very simple yeah. but i guess because it's also very spacious like yeah. look at the amount of space here yep so you you don't feel like it has a lot to offer but there's a lot there's to a lot yeah yeah and uh we did we did check out these drawers and we noticed that uh, they're very Let's see. Let's see. This is here. Yeah, remember when they're yeah. really nicely done as well. Eh? Yeah. And I noticed they went uh, with no handles here, so it's yeah. just all recessed. Yeah. And uh, that's a good feature to see. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And uh, again, you have a smoke extractor there. We just have you noticed uh, the cladding on the, yeah. the kitchen? Yeah. It's the yeah. same one we saw on the entry and transport. Yeah. yeah. And uh, moving again there, there's a big window behind you to yep. bring in tons of natural lighting. And double uh, sink. You didn't even notice double sink. I talked about <laughs> yeah. it. You weren't you paying did. attention. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, moving on to this side, you have your oven and your two microwaves. Yeah. I don't know why you need two microwaves, but uh, you have them there. Why not? Because if you're paying one to one million kilo shilling, you oh, I just not? might need yeah. <laughs> two. And uh, one thing I want us to capture this well is, mm -hmm. This uh, cabinetry has a pop-up feature. Yep. So you just press and it pops up. Yeah? Yeah. So I find that really nice. And that because of this feature, I, yeah. I've, I haven't seen this before. So yeah. this is the first time I'm actually seeing it. Huh? Yeah. I'm sure some of you have seen it. Yeah. <laughs> so and just uh, press. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty it. sure you've seen it watching NS. Of course, yeah. on, on 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 videos, house yeah. tours, but yeah. uh, on our house tours or oh yeah, it's yeah. it's very houses hard that to have visited itself, yeah, so, yeah. 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 And, and that's uh, a really nice feature because you can have all that. Uh, look at how clean it yeah. is. Look at that. Yeah, all you those drawers without a, without no a, handles. Yeah, and it's just perfect. This and is what I'm saying. I love minimalistic kitchen. Yes, yes, please. And just goes to show, guys, I hope you're taking on, to, taking notes. And uh, if you have the money, buy this house. Buy this house. And uh, moving on to this space, you have your pantry space. Uh, they have they have done the shopping for you. Yeah. Yeah, and uh, it's, it's small, but yeah. I guess it's enough space. I mean, quite decent, though. Quite, quite decent. Huh? Yeah. And moving on to this side, you have your laundry area, which mm -hmm. is spacious, my friend. Yeah. And even have this small sink set up here. Maybe to wash your pets. I don't know what else you can wash there. 
<laughs> we have seen this a couple of times. Well, if you are if you are mopping with water, then you can use that because you can actually a, yeah, use it directly. There's a yeah, provision. Because yeah. you have a provision for that. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. Really nice. Huh? Yeah. And I have to say that I noticed throughout the whole house they have used these square drains, yeah. which I find are uh, better looking than the other, and especially the metallic ones oh, okay. than the normal plastic no, yeah. cheap stuff that we. If no, my see even where we live. <laughs> <laughs> Again, here yeah, you get a lot of light coming in because the sun is actually going down yeah. it's in the afternoon, yeah. and uh, so all that sun is on us. You have your seat set up there, so you can have your washing machines here, mm. and uh, here is the staff quarters. Mm. Spacious, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's good space, yeah. It's a, it's like a good bed sitter. Yeah, yeah good bed sitter. Mm. Comes with a big window yeah. and a full bathroom as well. Mm -hmm. And let's move on quickly so that we can see the other areas. So, guys, I hope you're following how this house flows. Yeah. And uh, here, I did mention this when you were talking about the entrance porch. Mm -hmm. This is your lift. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So the lift accesses all the four levels that yeah. is your basement the ground level where we are right now and the two floors above us that yeah. you're going to see so this is the powder room and it has a smart toilet feature and even beyond before i even talk about that smart toilet can you talk about uh, oh this, yes the uh, vanity. vanity setup yeah look at the sink man this is huge and uh, we are not used to seeing such yeah. on the shop. Yeah. So this is a fast and a nice thing to see. Mm. Again, you have a very nice tub and your, van, your smart mirror as well. Yeah, of and, uh, tower racks are very nice, very beautiful. Yeah, yeah the shavers. Yeah, the shavers. Yeah, uh, they, like yeah they have them. Yeah, so that's a, this is a nice feature. So, and in most places, you don't get shavers in the, in the powder room. Yeah. So the fact that this powder room comes with the shavers yeah. is, is a plus. That is impressive. Because you can have a guest who is just visiting there and they want to quickly yeah. trim their beard. Eh? Yeah. Again, like I said, the toilet is a smart, um, smart toilet, mm -hmm. which you can even control the temperature. Yeah. So in case you want to heat your ass. <laughs> 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 to warm your ass and yeah. uh, even notice that it flashes in a different way yeah it really cleans up properly yeah you don't even need to use uh to clean it yourself per se mm -hmm. it's just people can see how it cleans up it's mm -hmm. really nice it's yeah. a yeah. smart feature like I said, you can warm up your ass. I find that so cool. Yeah, that is so cool. Yeah, that's really cool. <laughs> <laughs> so that's, that's, that's a really nice thing. Yeah. And smart toilets are expensive. For real. Remember the house we visited in? Actually, it was still Lavington. Yeah. But the, we never posted We never yeah. posted that video. Yeah. Uh, that toilet cost one million Kenya shilling. The toilet alone. Oh. Wow. So this house is wanted to one million Kenya shilling. So maybe so, you can see where the yeah, one million. Where the one million is coming from. <laughs> <laughs> Though I'm not sure about the price of this one, uh -huh. but that one we saw, yeah. that one, where that uh, toilet is one million Kenya shilling. Oh. So moving on, this is your guest bedroom, and uh, immediately you walk in, you have this uh, sort of your wardrobe setup. Yeah. And uh, this wardrobe, really is, I maybe you capture this in the payrolls yes. by how they light up when you open. Yeah. I like that so much. We're not used to seeing that feature in many houses, mm -hmm. so when we see it, we, we are happy. Yeah. Yeah, we're very happy. And even the handle that holds your clothes, my goodness, this is really nice. We yes, you have, you have to see that return. Yeah. And uh, again, part of your wardrobe setup is all glass. Yeah, which is, you, you can see through. Yeah, you can see through. I prefer this glass wardrobe setup because yeah. it means I can see my clothes the way they are laid out. Mm -hmm. And especially when, when you like order. Yeah, yeah. Those yeah. people, who, those of us who hang colors, yeah, together, yeah. all the yeah. white shirts, all the you know. <laughs> so this is really perfect for us. Yeah. And uh, from here, I can just walk onto the bed space, mm -hmm. and I will just use the other part. And uh, Tala, welcome yeah, to yeah. the bed space. I want to talk about this cladding. Mm -hmm. We have seen it in another apartment. One yeah. of the apartments that we toured when we were just starting the show. Yeah. Had uh, this very nice. Uh, you know, uh, top. Like yeah. they, they used uh, this sort of a marble setup to cover this area, mm -hmm. to clad it. Yeah? yeah. Again, big window. The whole house comes with a lot of it. 
maybe sh- we can count the number of times I'll say natural lighting. <laughs> <laughs> it will be a lot. <laughs> and next to you, it is there's another uh, wardrobe space. Yeah. So more space to storage space. Yeah. yeah and, and more lighting also. More lighting. Yeah. We didn't talk about that lighting. The lighting next to you. Ah yes. Yeah. Hanging by the bedside and all these track lights. Really beautiful. What what is what is the name used for them? Ascent, ascent, ascent lights. Light. And again, they continue from this angle. I can see the warm lighting just next to your curtain uh, yes. rails. Yeah? Yeah. And uh, comes with the full bathroom. Uh, so very nice sink setup. Mm-hmm. And uh, your toilet is there. Again, a big window. And even in the bathrooms, you yeah. get the warm lighting, yeah. the ambient lighting. And behind here is the shower area. I'm sure you're going to capture that later. Yes. That comes with a proper rain head, a handheld, and uh, the, the towel lock that we saw in the powder room. So moving on, I think we are done with the ground floor. Mm-hmm. Now let's take the stairs so that we can see the, uh, the basement. Yeah? Follow yep. me with this. These are well cladded with uh, wood and therefore they look, uh, it warms up the space. Yeah? Yeah. And even the railing on top of the, yeah, glass, the glass is yeah. uh, wood. Yeah? Mm. So welcome to your basement space. And there's this space where you can, your kids can store their toys, their bikes. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Again, you know, you know what I say, you can use this space to tell whether the house is big. Yeah. The moment you see a big space like this one, yeah. uh, you just know it's a big house. It's a big house, yeah. And uh, this is your elevator access, and uh, this door leads to your garage area. Yeah, maybe you can walk out. You can actually just yeah. walk out and uh, yeah. have a look at the garage. Yeah. And uh, welcome to your garage space. Yeah. This and fits about uh, four big cars, yeah, SUVs. This, this is very spacious. Yeah. This can fit big, four big cars. Yeah. And you actually have a, a big card there to show how yeah. you're talking about another one. The space is still a lot. This is a lot of space that you're talking about. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah, yeah. So, and you're not squeezing the cars in any way. Yeah. And notice that even your garage is well lit. Yeah, true. Yeah, yeah, true. yeah. yeah. So, uh, moving in, before you forget, uh-huh. they have used uh, Telazo. Yeah. For, oh, to floor the garage. Yeah, to floor the garage, which I think is a better material. Yeah. Yeah. So that's a good point to point out. Yeah? And uh, moving on back to the uh, house. Uh, this case, you can see that it's wood laminated. Yep. And this is more like your theater room. Yeah. Even or, the lighting. Or a man cave. Or a man cave. Or, what, or an entertainment room. <laughs> or an entertainment <laughs> room. In yeah. fact, you already have a provision for for your oh, yes. for your bar setup, yeah. So you can have your sinks here and do a very nice bar, bar here. setup, yeah. Yeah. So this this room just needs uh, you to bring in a designer, a, yeah. a very creative person, and they will spice it up for you. Yeah. yeah. And on this side, you have a, a room that you can already see past the glass window. Mm-hmm. You can see that you have a, this area can be used as a gym. Yeah. Yeah. So for those of you who like to work out. This or, is like a private gym. Yeah, yeah, this is a private gym. We can use it as a, uh, a, a, a kid's bedroom as well. Mm. You can also use it as a staff quarter, an extra staff quarter. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, especially if you have more than two people working for you. Mm-hmm. Or you can also have it as a guest bedroom. Or an office. Yeah. Yeah, or an office, mm. especially when you're hosting uh, big parties and some of your boys sleep over. Yeah. It's an extra space. It's an extra space. space, yeah. We're saying that because it has a wardrobe set up. Mm-hmm. And I think we're going to open all these wardrobes just to see that warm light. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and there it goes. Nice. Again, it's a proper bedroom despite being on the basement level because you can access your outdoors yeah. easily yeah. from this section and from that section. Yes. And uh, moving on. And for those who might be wondering, how about if I use it as a bedroom, what am I going to do about this? You have your curtain uh, yeah. rails done. Yeah. How can I forget to talk about the bathroom? Yeah, because I thought you were, comes... you were just going to pass it because there's, <laughs> there's going to be a lot of this. There's going to be a lot of bathrooms to yeah. see. So maybe we jump some. That is your sink setup. Yeah. Uh, your, um, your water closet. And uh, 
this is your bathroom. You never talked about uh, how that platform is raised. I was gonna talk about it right now. Yeah. <laughs> and I hope that we actually see it better in another, I think the primary bedroom. Primary bedroom, yeah. So that because it was raised all around. Yeah. But yeah, this place where you're standing as you take your shower, guys, mm -hmm. it is raised, which means that your water will slip down to this section. Yeah. I can actually, I'm sure you can see the separation of tiling, yeah? Yeah. So this part is a platform, raised platform, and your water goes all the way to your square drain. Yeah. Yeah. Nice, and you have your handheld tiled all the way to the top, and that is your rain head and a window. Yeah, and Green this is one of those light. mirrors I can't get away from. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and those ladies. <laughs> <laughs> so, you get to see him. Today, we get to see the whole team, by the way. Yeah. So, this is hopefully, we'll see Ray. Hopefully, we're going to see Ray. Yeah. Yeah. Hopefully, we're going to see Ray as well. Yeah. And uh, now, we are done with the basement level. Let's take uh, the lift so that we can see what the first floor has to offer. And uh, Espes, what, what is the overall general thoughts about the house? Uh, this, is the, the, this is my best house in the channel so, so far. far. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, best house? Yeah. Okay, I wanted to, to do some comparison, but I know people will be mad. <laughs> why, why are you comparing when someone gives you the house to review? Yeah, why are you going? You actually yeah. pressed open instead of close. So, we're in the lift, guys, and uh, it's a. Uh, I mean, it's a small lift, guy, 400 kg, just five people. Because yeah. I mean, it's, it's home lift. Again, yeah. another mirror can get oh, away way. from <laughs> that. <we're seeing> this. <laughs> <laughs> and guys, uh, wow! I know some of you want to come to the show. Yeah. And uh, hopefully, very soon, we we'll start inviting guys to the to tour with us. Some of these oh, homes. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, so that you can also see the houses as as we tour them and review them. So welcome of your elevator space, yeah. and uh, you're welcome to this uh, family area. Mm -hmm. And I think I forgot to talk about the cladding, yeah. which is really well done. Yeah, and also uh, in the living room, I noticed that some part of it is sort of bookmarked. They yeah. tried to bookmark. Uh, you can actually it try and show it. And uh, from here, as I was saying, you can have your very nice. A party's ball. Mm. It's like this. Yeah, room, this your living room actually like looks like a ballroom. Yeah, it's from like a here. ballroom from up here. Yeah, and uh, wow, enjoy, guys. Welcome to my house. <laughs> Today we are. <laughs> Who you let know, you? When you, <laughs> when, when you have to uh, do the champagne glass thing. Oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> ta ta ta. <laughs> so that they can keep calm and yeah. quiet. Now you have to address them. Oh, this is yes. this is yeah. very nice. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And also, um, the rails are high, very high. Yeah. So, so your kids cannot topple over. And it's strong. Yeah. Yeah. yeah and those strong. who might think uh, it's this is weak because it's glass. Yeah. It's uh, well fixed. It's well fixed into the wall. Yeah. So it's very strong and high, as Will is saying. Mm -hmm. Again, the tiling is really nice. I have to commend that. And uh, before we check out the bedrooms, let's talk about this balcony space. There's a lot of open spaces in this house. And uh, guys, welcome to your balcony area, uh, which is uh, really nice. And uh, from here, we get closer again to the travel team. Yeah. Yeah. So can you imagine the amount of money they spent uh, clad in this house? On the travel team and the PVC. It's definitely worth 121. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's, a, it's, a, it's a good uh, thing that they actually went to all this extent. Yeah. yeah. And also there's some um, accent lighting on the walls. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Right, right now you might not be able to see it. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah. But we uh, don't have them on because, of course, the, it's during the day. In the evening, it would be nice to see. Yeah? yeah. And this is a lot of space for a balcony. Yes. Like we see in the other balcony. Balconies in this house are big. Yeah, they, <laughs> they don't look like an afterthought. Yeah, they are. Oh, yeah. They are definitely not an afterthought. Yeah. In fact, we have been arguing that the balconies are so, at some point bigger than the indoors. Yeah. 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 And uh, here we can start with this bedroom. And uh, this is more like a junior uh, bed, uh, primary, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, so you have your bed space here, you have your lighting, very well that access lighting, mm -hmm. and uh, you have that light hanging, and uh, your windows bring in tons of natural light. You have all this window. This is looking to, 
out to the street. Mm. Let's walk into the balcony space. As I was saying, the balconies are huge. Yeah, the balconies and are huge. And you have these trees dropping all the leaves here, so <laughs> you'll have a lot of cleaning to do. I but mean, <laughs> it's not a big price to pay to have yeah. a tree. Yeah. Again, notice that this is even way higher than on the other oh, side. Yeah, than the other side. So, so this is really nice. So if you have your, your children are using this bedroom, mm -hmm. you know that they're safe, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, this is higher than even the steel rails that you're used to seeing. Yeah. And behind you, there's one of the pillars that goes all the way to the top. And I like how uh, they left it exposed. Yeah. It just runs from the floor all the, all way. the way to the top. Yeah. It's really nice. It's a, it's a really nice cool feature. You can even see the ceiling. And uh, I think they went with the TNG ceiling yeah. from here. I'm sure we'll be able to... Uh, the even same material here. that they used here. Yeah. This is nice. Like, we saw this in house in Membe. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And I remember saying that uh, when we were growing up, people used to use TNG uh, the... Yeah, the rich. The, <laughs> the, the ones, <laughs> It was a dynasty. It was a dynasty of our time. <laughs> so now it's rare to see people using TNG. Yeah. So when we see it being used, uh, it is yeah. quite a plus. I think the lights are back, yeah? Yeah, the lights are back. Oh, that's a nice thing that you have just said. Yeah. Because Willis has just pointed out that the area has a backup, a full yeah. backup generator. generator. Yeah. Not partial for main areas yeah. but a full backup but again when you pay 121 million guys i mean it's definitely worth everything you should definitely get that <laughs> yeah so moving on we have a scene i like that when in these bedrooms you don't see your wardrobes yeah guys if you're sleeping in the same room with your clothes <laughs> <laughs> work hard, work hard. <laughs> and if you're building a house and you're building in a way that the clothes will be sleeping within the same room, that's unfortunate. So yes, yeah. I want you to go inside the washroom mm -hmm. so that when I open these doors, they can see the yeah. lighting. Yeah, yeah. That's Amazing. Ah, it's cute. Yeah. And don't you even like the color that they went with for yeah, this Yeah, the, the dark tones. Yeah. The dark tones. They're really nice. They just make you feel like you want to dress up nicely. Mm -hmm. ah, man. When you live in this house, you'll have cold, cold clothes, I guess. Yeah, I think I think if I live in this house, I'd just be wearing formal clothes. Because yes. Oh, yeah. Yeah, the, it just looks James Bond-like. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Right. It just want very nice shirts and suits. Yeah. In fact, I would just do away with uh, these brocks. And, and I have mean, uh, nice. Yeah, that would be class. nice. Yeah. yeah. So, and I want you to step outside so that now we can have a look at the washroom, mm. which is big. I would have fitted inside there with you, you know? Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> I made it sound smaller. Eh? Yeah. So again, here we can see the raised platform. Yep. On all the three Let sides. Let me try and get so, a bit of... This yeah. is very good because it means when you're taking a shower, mm -hmm. you don't magic, you know how water you're not standing yeah, on water. On water. Your water is just going to the sides. Mm. Uh, th that's a very nice. The recessed uh, places to place your shower gels and so on. Shampoos, whatever. And uh, your rain head, your hard held. And again, on this, even um, the floating. Uh, oh, the yeah. floating uh, water closet. Water closet. And again, a big window here to bring in tons of natural lighting. And uh, you have your warm lighting. This place, I don't even know why they put all these down lighters because you don't need them with yeah. these windows. But I guess at, at night. Yeah. Oh, at, yeah. yeah. Oh, at night for sure. And for those of you who worry about uh, privacy, you can see that this, you can see, people can see you. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And uh, you have your medicine cabinetry, uh, which, is, which is cute. Nice to see, yeah. Mm -hmm. And uh, your shavers there. Let's move on and check out uh, the other bedroom. Let's check out uh, the other two bedrooms quickly. This bedroom is very much alike the, like the bedroom that we saw downstairs. Eh? So mm -hmm. is, we can just walk that way. We show them quickly. That's how it looks like. Even the bathroom is similar. Yeah. So we can just move on to the other bedroom on this other side, which is also pretty much like that one. Yeah. So you have your wardrobe spacing again, and you have the big windows in terms of natural lighting you can have two other windows there and you have your accent lighting and a bathroom almost similar to the one on the other side there yeah? yeah so we can just uh, move on to the other level 
and uh, Willis is complaining that we're using stairs when we have an elevator. <laughs> but uh, let's just take the stairs so that we can enjoy this window that we talked about when we were starting the show. Yeah. So it runs from the floor yeah. all the all way, way to the ceiling. Yeah. And that is a three level ceiling, mm -hmm. minus the basement floor. Yeah. It doesn't go all the way to the basement, it starts at the ground level, yeah. all the way to the upper ceiling. Yeah. And uh, therefore, it gives you a very high ceiling here. So it means you have a lot of natural lighting here. And uh, welcome to your third, your fourth level actually. Mm -hmm. And you have uh, off, the fourth, off the landing, you have uh, your elevator access. And on this side, we have uh, the primary bedroom. And I want us, every time I, we post videos, we say, in case you're interested in the house, call remote. So when you call you when you guys when you call that number, you guys always think you're talking to me. Yeah. But like we say it's Raymond. Yeah. So we're going to invite Raymond so that he can do the primary bedroom presentation. Yeah. So that you can put a face to the person you talk to when you call. Mr. Raymond, <laughs> welcome to the show. Hi guys. So finally people get to see yes. for those of you who don't know, when we say call Ray, this is Ray. I am Mark, so it's I'm not him. my number. When you call him, don't call him Mark. Call him, <laughs> it's Ray, as yes. said there. And uh, Karibu Sam, you had to Sante. use the elevator instead of the stairs. Yeah, I was, at, I was holed up at the basement, so. Okay, yeah. Yes. And that's, that's four levels. Yes. So we want you to help us uh, showcase the, the primary yeah, bedroom. For the good stuff. Yes, <laughs> take the lead. Yeah, <laughs> and, so. Uh, tell us. First thing that hits you, uh -huh. it's the walk-in closet. Wow, continue. By the size of it, uh -huh. we clearly know yeah. his and hers. <laughs> <laughs> so, so this is the... We're actually having a, that debate earlier yeah. on. Yeah. And we realized that uh, at the end of the day, all this would be hers. Mm. Actually, yeah. Yes. Because, uh, think, yeah. Uh, However, there's another space that we're going to see there. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so, Ray, continue. Yeah, so, where's the bed? Oh. I think you can follow me. <laughs> yeah. So, the bed will come all the way. Yeah. Even, even a seven foot bed. Yeah. So for those, those there's Shaquille O'Neal height. California bed. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, they can do that kind of bed here. Yeah, and, yeah. Uh, then you remember, there was that house. Remember, there was that house we did. We did on our TikTok reels, mm -hmm. where we showed the L-shaped balcony. Oh yeah. So yeah, yeah. at a slightly smaller scale, yeah. but equally big for Nairobi. Yeah. Yeah. Especially so, for Lavington. You have all this. This is awesome. This is yeah. big. This is very spacious. It's actually all big. This. What can you do with this space? My goodness. I mean, you yeah. can put the whole ceiling space here. Yeah. And yeah. you, you already have your ceiling cantilevering over this yeah. space. Oh my. So you don't even have to put anything above. Is this TNG, by the way? This is TNG. Ah. That is how you, when you were kids. Yeah. That's how you knew those are dynasties. <laughs> <laughs> well, so you still... Like, yeah, you can turn those uh, outdoors yeah. yeah. bed here. Yeah. A day bed. Yeah, a day bed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> You can, you, you know what? You can even have an outdoor yeah, so bus can, setup. Yeah. 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 yeah, definitely. This yeah. was uh, awesome. Yeah. So, uh, and you have forgotten this light. Oh, the asset light. Yeah. Damn. Yeah. There's so much I can do with. with it, what would you do? With All this these, including this. this. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and, I'm not saying anything. And uh, again, your rails are very high. Yeah. So I wanted to say something, but maybe not a very nice thing about yeah. someone who fell off a balcony when they yeah. were drunk. You remember? Oh, yeah. He was a hero yeah. Yeah. in our country. And uh, so with this, I bet you would have been safe. And look at the height. <laughs> it's very high. Yeah. It's very high. So you can fall. You'd have yeah. to really want to fall. Yeah. For you to fall. To fall. Like for you, you should to be fall. extremely determined. Yeah. <laughs> so enough of falling down. And uh, so the earth continues all the way, as you can see, guys. Yeah. So Ray, continue. So, where's the shower? Is it even... Before you talk about the shower, you're forgetting oh. something. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Let's... Right behind your... Oh. Right oh, behind yeah. this bed space. Mm -hmm. well, this is not what you're expecting. Yeah. Trust me. Yeah. Just show them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so, the late night coffees, as you discuss how you're going to clear the mortgage. 
Oh, this yeah. is where you sit. Yeah. <laughs> With the missus there. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, as you enjoy some coffee yeah. in your kitchen at. I yeah. thought you're, you're going to discuss uh, your Bali trip or uh, your. That one you do outside. Uh, <laughs> with the setup. <laughs> yeah, on the day bed. Yeah, on the day bed. <laughs> on the day yeah, bed. So, where you promise all the sweet nothings. Yeah, yeah. actually, yeah. the kitchen can be somewhere where you and your wife can eat it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> we, There's also a provision for uh, your fridge there. Yeah. Yeah. So, we acknowledge the self censorship. Yeah. <laughs> so moving on to the bathroom. Yeah. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yes. My, my. What do we have here? Mm-hmm. So let's start with the obvious mm-hmm. before we go to the non obvious. Yes. So, of course, you've got this vanity setup, his and hers, yeah. with proper spacing. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. So it's not squeezed. They're not squeezed. Yeah. 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 So, and of course, the tub. Yeah. What do we call this glass? I don't know what, what we call it. Mm-hmm. Someone should comment there. I'm sure Please enlighten knows. us. Yeah, enlighten us. Yes. We are not used to it. So <laughs> this kind of glass. And something I noticed about the tub, it's actually Willis who noticed it. Yeah. So your tub has this section. I'm sure Willis mm-hmm. will get it in the B-rolls. Yeah. So in case you leave your tub uh, running. running and you'll have to take a phone call yeah. or you're arguing with the missus, mm-hmm. uh, your water won't flow uh, down here. So to just go through that section, and yes. that's really cool. Wow. <laughs> yeah. Then of course. What do you call this tub? A freestanding tub. <laughs> oh, yeah. the only free thing we have in this country. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nice one. Yeah. yeah. So, <laughs> of course, you've got your water the closet. water closet set up there. Yeah. yeah. With a help us be there. Yeah. Uh, and uh, a big one, a big big ass bidet for that one. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, as Mark told you earlier, uh-huh. with the shower, yeah, how they have raised the platform, the, the platform area. as you shower, so the water just flows. Yeah. So, and it's a huge shower. Yeah. And I wish they actually they I wish they had done two rain heads. Yeah. Because it would have been perfect for you to take two shower, like you can shower together without mm. really getting into each other's space. Yeah. Yeah. yeah because it's big enough. I want you to share the water. Okay, save yes. water. That's important. Improve on intimacy. <laughs> yes. And uh, something I, I forgot to mention in the yeah. other bedrooms, or rather the whole house, is that this, the sisters are well hidden. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. This is a very nice feature. So, wow. Yeah. Good to notice. Mm. Wait, there's something that you haven't talked about. So, maybe, so, I don't know, does Willis really pan up first? Or? <laughs> Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Just do it. Oh, yeah. Get so, it yeah. okay. So there's a remote here. So, yeah, there's a remote here. Yes, I know you can't and feel it in the camera, but, but you're having a lot of fresh air inside the bathroom. And a sunroof effect. And See, like when you're in a car and there's a sunroof, yeah. this is how someone shines <laughs> at this particular spot. So we have a skylight, yes. but not just your usual skylight. Check that out. This is a retractable skylight, and, and now it's closing. Yeah. So I'm sure the bureau will capture that nicely. Wow. And so when you walk into your shower and uh, you want uh, some fresh air, you just there you have it. Yeah, a skylight that you just want to dry up quickly without a towel. I hate uh, rich people flex. Yeah. 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 You don't use towels. (laughs) They're for persons. You've just reminded me. I was actually telling a friend of a uh, lecturer. Yeah. I think it was called Miss, 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 Mr. Ugut or something. He used yeah. to teach us English. 11, 11 or 5, 11, 9. I'm okay. not sure. Back in campus, yeah. Yeah, but he used to tell us about that, that flex of you yeah. know, dry, like, I don't know what it's called. <laughs> Weird stuff. Yes, actually, there, there, are, there are some inventions that cater for that. Yeah. I'm sure pretty much during our future episodes. Yeah. We'll cover a house with that. With that kind yeah. of thing. So yeah. I'm, I'm yeah. very sure about that. Yeah. This house has been very interesting to tour, and yes. we are not done yet. So moving on, for those, for when we talked about the wardrobes, we said that this will probably be a house only. However, yeah. if I was to advise the yeah. missus of the house, I would say that this should actually be his. Yeah? His, and now let me show you what hers should be. And 
Welcome to this space, which you yep. could use as another closet. It would be a perfect working closet. Yeah. Because I don't expect uh, for you to, a woman who owns this house, to fit her clothes in that. Mm. So this is a good uh, room. It's spacious enough. Mm. And again, you can use it as an office if you don't want to use it as a closet. It has a huge balcony. Very All big. the way. Yeah, Ray can walk inside. Yeah. All the way. Just follow Ray. Yeah. So, and one thing, I noticed there's a, a provision yeah. for maybe a TV. Mm -hmm. So your wife can get, you know, real estate ideas from your favorite YouTube, real estate YouTube channel, The Man Supply. <laughs> the Man Supply. As she pressures you oh, yeah. on buying another house. Oh, yeah. Because, I mean, yeah. what's better than one house? Two, right? <laughs> <laughs> nice one. Yeah. And uh, you have another provision here that you can use. I don't know what you use this space for. Uh, but it's there. Using this as your walking closet, then this is going to be your shoes. The shoe closet, yeah? yeah. Realistically, yeah. she will take that uh -huh. walking closet, this, this, and then you will be this. told, tuck your take, suits. Tuck your suits here. <laughs> that, <laughs> she, she'll be, actually, she'll just con, con, construct some tacky thing yeah. to just hang your, your, your coat. So. You'll be told that cold room by the corner. <laughs> So that's what you get for paying for this house. It's so much for paying for the house. <laughs> so, and yeah. uh, moving on, the, you notice that the primary bedroom gets the whole floor, yeah? yeah. yeah. So, and, and as a plus, you get this uh, very big terrace. Oh. Wow. Or rather, a rooftop, yeah? yeah? This is huge. This is massive. And, uh, wow, it's burning. I can't even see clearly. Let me put on my glasses. This is a lot Look of space. We just go all the way to the end so that they can you see. You can how actually do a, a mini volley match here. Yeah. yeah. Or yeah. some light touch football. Yeah. And the lighting is all done for you. So yes. barbecue nights will be lit. Hey. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. 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 So you have a, a place where you can have a man cave down in the basement, a theater room, an entertainment room, and then you have this space. So, guys, I don't know what much more you would want. For actually. It's quite... It's quite a lot. It's quite a lot. Do you think it's value for money? Yes. Yeah. Uh, it's value for money. Yeah. Considering what you're getting at this price point. Yeah. In other areas. Yeah. Maybe someone might say probably it's the space. Yeah. Maybe for... Maybe... Did you show them the garden? The, we should, the yeah, we tiny them, garden? Yeah. yeah. Probably someone might say maybe for the money uh -huh. the, the garden is... But yeah. I think for the location. Yeah. Since you are in Lovington. Yeah. And here you have access to so many amenities yeah. than, that you wouldn't get in other like, places, other places yeah. which are far yeah. flung. Yeah. I think it's value for money. You're very close to the yeah. town, CBD. Yes. You're very close to Westrads, Upper Hill, mm. uh, uh, Kilimani. Mm. And uh, you're very close to very international schools, yeah. shopping malls. You're spoiled for choice. Yeah. You want to go to Ayakiwe, just take James Gishul. You want yeah. to go to Gong Road, just drive uh, five minutes. Huh? Mm. You want to go to CBD or the airport? It's a it's a very easily accessible. And uh, in terms of where this place is, I think location is very safe. It's safe. Yeah. And in case also you want to give a petition to the president, state house is not far. Oh yeah. yeah so good luck with that. <laughs> and even the high courts are not that far. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so maybe we should have a we should do a chango for Okiyom Tata. He yeah. <laughs> needs such a house. <laughs> Actually, Okiya needs. Such a house. Yeah, yeah. That's a nice joke. Yeah. <laughs> so guys, yeah. thank you, thank you so much uh, for watching this episode. And again, that is Ray. So every, Hi guys. whenever you call, <laughs> just know it's Ray you're calling. And mm. um, I'm your host, Mark, Mark Mansa. And uh, behind the camera is Willis as usual. Oh, thank Ken Willis! Thank as I Yes, as they call him, the streets. <laughs> <laughs> so thank you, thank you very much. Uh, it's been an honor to work with you, to have you uh, watching these shows. And uh, if you haven't subscribed, please, please consider subscribing. And uh, see you on the next episode. Meantime, I think we've, I think I want to soak in that tub. So bye, guys. <laughs> well, I have to go. Kim will do the tubs. <laughs> I saw there was only one tub, so. <laughs> oh, yeah. There should be another tub. <laughs>